You have to blow up the um, screen just a second. And guess who? Look, y'all, look at this miniature uh, lantern. And guess who's in here? <laughs> Natty Poo. You playing, mama? Look at her shirt, y'all. Can you show me your shirt? Move your hand. It says crawl, walk, ride. Brown sugar baby, 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 but, yeah, we uh, y'all know we've been busy as usual. We got the car full, but everybody sleep except us. As y'all know, I'm the nation king. I'm the nation queen. We got the nation, the nation crew back there. Yeah, nation crew. The nation crew. And together. Sleep. And together we are Smith, Smith nation. nation. Hey, welcome back to our channel, y'all. Welcome back. We missed y'all. Yeah, Hope we Hope y'all miss missed us. We, I, I, I want y'all to know that, like, we gonna be on YouTube. We just not consistent. Like, when we when we post something, it's gonna be popping. We ain't just no random, you know, just every day. Like, oh, yeah. not yet. We ain't got we ain't got the meat, the time for that right now, y'all. But yeah, we, we do our best. Guess what we're headed to do? We are house hunting. Yeah. yeah so as y'all know, we um we live in a house now, but we kind of outgrowing this home so we are on the mission to find us a new house for our family and we want to take y'all along this journey with us so i know a lot of y'all are here for the update so if y'all want to update on the pregnancy test and everything go to my instagram go to my igtv and that's where the update is cool okay after we search for a few homes this is gonna this is gonna actually be a long process guys and y'all know the market is kind of so bad right now well it's, it's a seller's market so if anybody's selling their home they have better luck you know with selling and stuff like that versus buying a home so the market is so good all the houses that you know we're trying to buy you have to bid so much over asking price so yeah a lot of y'all don't know but i i was a realtor at one point so my mom is our realtor now though but yeah so we're house hunting looking for a house and um what else after that we're gonna take the, the kiddos want to do a movie night at their grandfather's house so we're gonna go do that and that's gonna be fun but after that we're probably gonna go home change clothes you know get comfortable and then we'll uh come back and do the movie night but yeah, so we're just out looking for houses right now. And we're gonna kinda show y'all maybe a few of them or, we might do that on another video. We might just, we, we're kinda just letting y'all know right now because we kinda, you know, we be late all the time. So it's getting late and we might not get to see all the houses we wanna see. So yeah, so we might just uh, have a whole another video dedicated to that and yeah. But we just letting y'all know, keeping y'all in the loop, that we're looking for a house. We we kind of we can afford something good that we like. We can upgrade. So and uh, we all we wearing red today, y'all. So y'all want to see these pictures? Well, I already know what to do. Yeah, I already know. We're gonna take a couple pictures when we get our little matching sets and stuff. But um, our anniversary is coming up. We're coming up on six years. Six years, y'all. Come in down below. Who been here since? You know that first video we made about how we met. Who been here since then? That was like 2015, 2016. Yeah. yeah who's been here when, when Nixie was just a baby? Yeah. Who been here since? How, matter of fact, Super. forget that. We ain't. It ain't no competition. Just comment down below. How long you been here? Are you new here? Have you been here since? What video did you see first? The brown sugar baby? I know y'all, a lot of y'all came from that video, but just comment down below, let us know when y'all got here. 
Because I want to know. I like our YouTube family. I love y'all. Y'all real supportive, most of y'all. Some of y'all be saying some mean stuff sometimes, but honey, in this industry, we learn you can't let that phase you. Like I said in my IGTV video, yeah, if you can't stand the heat, get out the kitchen. And I'm hot. I like it hot, you feel me? So I like the kitchen. So y'all can say what y'all want to say. It don't phase me. I ain't never been no insecure person. So, you know. I think that's why we wearing red today, you know. Yeah. We like the heat. Known to get a color red to blues. <laughs> Let us know what y'all, give us some ideas to for our anniversary. You know, what things do y'all do? Do yeah, do because we're not we're not doing nothing like big big this year. We plan on doing something big probably for our 10 year um, anniversary. Oh, but yeah. we we got something planned for our 30th birthday. Y'all yeah. know we turning 30 this year, so that's what we gonna do it big at. At the same time. No. Yeah, we turn we turn 30 in the same month. So yeah. so yeah, that's what we gonna do something big this year. So comment down below what can we do at home? You know to try to just celebrate. Uh, probably without the kids, yeah, definitely without the kids. But yeah, y'all like us in red? We like some hot Cheetos or no? <laughs> some Kool Aid pickles. I'm not a big fan of the color red, but the way it's popping, like you like, I like this color. I like red, but I think I, I do think, not like red at all, y'all. I think our color or y'all color is orange. I think yeah, that's, orange, that's orange, and. It's really just orange. Yeah, orange. <laughs> that's the color. I feel like that's our best color. Yeah. But this red is popping. I tried to do my little makeup, y'all. Y'all see it? Hold on. I tried to do a little red. How I do? My eyebrows too thick. <laughs> but I don't, I don't really know what I'm doing with makeup, but I be trying. Hey, you look beautiful, man. Thanks. Oh, I have a question, y'all. Okay, so y'all know Nixia is five years old and um, she started school, homeschool, but um, then the pandemic and stuff happened and they started doing the kids in school, I mean, online. So I was like, okay, I just put online. Oh, that's what it was. I got pregnant. And then I was so sick and I could not keep up with that homeschool, y'all. So I put her in virtual school and she did really good with that. It was still kind of hard. You know, I had to get up and make sure everything was good. But now, y'all know these schools opening back up. They're not letting these kids wear masks. They're not letting them do online no more. So I'm kind of confused. I don't know what to do. Should I go back to homeschool? And then Naomi's turn four, so now she can go to school. So should I just homeschool them both? Should I put her in school? How do y'all feel about homeschool and stuff like that? Do y'all think the kids miss out on some stuff is it important right now or should i wait till a certain because honestly the kids that i done met that be in regular school they be bad i'm just be honest with y'all they be bad and i don't want my kids to be exposed to all that junk i know I, they, they really strong kids you know they um strong-minded and i teach i try to teach them well and teach them when i when they go out in public when they go like to their grandparents house cousins houses friend houses that they um you know, they still, I teach them about integrity. I always tell them about integrity and how important it is to do things that are good even when no no one is watching. I don't want them to be exposed to that junk. Like, I want to protect them as long as possible. And I really struggle with that. Like, I like y'all know I'm, I'm strong and y'all probably feel like I do a lot, I know a lot, but when it comes down to this school stuff, that I am stuck on stupid. I did not want my kids to get, like I was, not looking forward to them turning to school age, you know, just so fast and it came so fast. Now I don't know what to do. Yeah, I struggle with getting to this point and I really, I'm really struggling. Like, I'm just be honest with y'all. My heart deep down inside, I do not want to do this. I know every parent, every mother struggle with that, that moment where they have to send their kid to school, but no, mine is a little deeper than that. Like, I, it's not the fact that I don't want, I'm not scared that I don't want them to go out and go to school. I don't want them exposed to certain stuff. Like, that's my biggest issue. Because once you expose them to something, it's really, really hard to, you can't unexpose them. You can't unsee it. And yeah, that's my biggest issue. So y'all comment down below, give me some advice, some encouragement. Let me know what y'all think I should do and how I should do it. 
Yeah. I think uh, for me, I know I'm scared because I was scared for them. But wait, you didn't tell him you were a teacher, actually. Oh, okay. So he's well. a. So actually, I'm a, I'm a teacher. Yeah, uh, I don't know if it, y'all know, but yeah. he's an actual teacher. I'm an actual teacher. Um, used to be coach, not coaching right now. He don't teach elementary, so. Uh, yeah, I teach teach high school. Uh, I'm not really scared, but I'm nervous for my kids and me because now in Texas, public schools are are not allowed. Oh no, no, they're not, they're not allowed to require for kids to wear a mask. So that means that and. The kids haven't been vac vax how you say it? Vax vaccinated. The kids haven't been vaccinated yet. So that is another thing. You know, kids are not getting vaccinated and you're taking off masks. So that's that's that makes me and that makes me nervous because they still have a chance to get the uh disease. Oh, okay, well so my wife just informed me that twelve and up can get the vaccination. So but still so that still scares me for my kids because now they they still can get it. How do y'all feel about that? Um, what are y'all doing to, you know, just help prevent it or are y'all keeping y'all kid home or, what you know, what are y'all doing? Um, yeah, and with these new babies, we're not trying to have that stuff brought home. And kids, you know, like I teach the girls about cleanliness and how to stay away from germs and stuff like that, but they still kids at the end of the day, so. They ain't gonna just be paying attention. They trying to talk to their friends and meet new people and just keep being kids. Mm -hmm. So it's gonna be hard to really prevent that. Yep. So they, they probably gonna have a vaccination for kids pretty soon. Hopefully. And then I don't even know how I feel about that. So. Yeah, cause you know you got adults getting headaches and feeling bad and feeling sick and after getting the vaccination, but you know. We'll see how it goes and see what happens this summer and see if anything changes for the kids. And also, they also, I heard they're getting rid of, they might be getting rid of virtual schools. So there will be no vir no more virtuals for some public schools. So they will either have to be homeschooled or they will have to be uh, go in person. So uh, we'll see, we'll see what happens. Yeah, so, okay, we're going to check back in with y'all after we, we might show y'all a couple houses. We got to hurry up now. If not, then we'll just show y'all on the next vlog, but um, we're going to show y'all the movie night, so get ready for that. That's going to be so cute. Yep. All right. Peace. Okay, guys. Okay, so we are done with the house. Um looking for houses we looked at a few we didn't get to record we, we forgot the camera we just it was too much going on but we're going to have a we're gonna to have to look again because it got it got it started to get late and then y'all know we have to go do the movie night so that's what we're about to go do we're about to change clothes get comfortable and then we'll check back in with y'all once we get um over there so yeah okay so we are getting ready this box was sent to us by DreamWorks to help us celebrate the movie spirit. So we're going to have an outdoor movie night with the That's cousins. Yeah. Who is that, Jaden? Chickalinda. Chickalinda. So the, with the boys out here have helping me set up and my sister's inside setting up. So we got the different colored little tubing thingies for them to sit out here. We got a beautiful little view to enjoy. So yeah, we're gonna get this party started. Good job, Knight. Okay, so we're setting up. We got some good goodies here. The girls are gonna love this. They got a little planner, calendar type deal. Some goodies, a bag, like what? Knight, get off the thing. Okay, so Nixie got another pool. Next time we gonna put some water in there and let them sit in their in swimsuits and watch. Thank you, girl. It is, you like it? What you say? Hey, ooh, it's cute. Uh, that's a puzzle, jigsaw puzzle. That's cool. 
like ugly. Right. Yeah, put that in the other pool, the one that don't have nothing in it. You see over there, Nick? That's for the girl over there? Yeah. So what else you need? You need one of these. Keychain. Put that in the pool. Two of these in each one of the pools. Not this one, we gotta wait for the next pool. Not that one. Yeah, let's go. Boys don't get that. Watch out for that ant bed. I know you. Wait, wait. Look, I want this. I want, okay. Look at that again. I want this one. Wait, can we like? They, didn't, they can't have the horses without no dogs. The boys can have those black horses. Just drop them. Can we put the uh, horses in now? No. Now we got dogs. Y'all gotta have these. Can, can we share? put the, these? We're gonna bring Tay Tay right here too so we can get a little video. Wait, it's, it's another black one. Yeah, this for you and I. Oh, yeah, I'm not scared of Tay Tay. Wait, did you say the. Look, look this way. Did you say the real All right, we're getting ready for the celebration. Yay! Night, you ain't gonna say nothing, buddy? Say yay! Yeah. <laughs> he says that. So, yeah, it came with a lot of horses and. Okay, wait, wait, one more. Okay, y'all can pick a horse and then come put it inside your. Uh, what are we gonna call these things? What should we call these? Sex. Uh, y'all. Pool sex. Okay. No. Pool, Kennedy said we should call it pool sex. So. No. Everybody, what? What you think? Pool. I think we should. Pool. That's what I said, Jay. I like pool sex. Cause like a, a, a pool bag, like a sleeping bag, or. And then you can put a movie in. night. Yeah. We just gonna stick with pool sex. So y'all take your horses, pick a horse, and come put it in your pool sex. So that's yours, okay? Wait, this is huh? yeah, this your she pool. woke up. No, okay. this pool right here. No, this is your pool. This is my pool. Okay, this is nice. Like, night, come put yours in here. The hanger, so we can hang up the little lights. And I got these from Amazon. Just twist it, put it on. We can hang up the little lights. What like? Oh, I ain't important. Okay, so yeah, so you just kind of twist it together and then you just stick it in the ground. It's really easy. So I'm just stepping on it, sticking it in. They can have a little light to sit by their pools. This is the light that I got from Amazon also. These are the lights and I think they're solar. So they come on like, yeah, it's so like a little solar panel. Yeah, so I think these are, um, like they automatically come on. Mm -hmm. So we gonna see. Okay, go hang it, Nixie. Night, don't kick the dog. No, no. Don't do that. Hang it on the little hook. Got it? Perfect. Uh, I need to extend that one, so I gotta make it a little longer. Okay. So, Nixie, what color you want? Red. Okay, get it. Nixie. Nami, what color you want? Now that's for night. You want orange, Nami? No. Yellow? Okay. Okay. So we're getting ready for the movie night. We have to blow up the um, screen just a second. And guess who? Look, y'all, look at this miniature uh, lantern. And guess who's in here? Shirt, y'all. Can you show me shirt? Move your hand. It says crawl, walk, ride. Alrighty, they getting ready for the movie night, guys. Yeah! I want to saddle. Who is that, Nolan? What's your dog? 
Cute. Clear. Pull them out. <laughs> so just pull them out. Like I want mine to be Showtime. Showtime? What's your horse name now? Dad. Who? Dad. Uh, oh, Black Lives Matter. Black Lives Matter. So we got Showtime. Hold them up. Hold them up, boys. Hold it up now. My, my horse name So we got it. Showtime and we got Black Lives Matter, y'all. What's up, y'all? Hey, y'all. We almost ready. Just waiting on the... Hey! See the babies in the back? They ready? Hey! They ready? So they've opened their horses. We waiting on the... Uh, waiting on it to get dark. So we can watch our movie. Shout out to Spirit. That's why he asked Say it louder. Nice and gay, yeah. Next year? Next again, yeah! Next again, yeah! <laughs> Next again, yeah! <laughs> what you gonna say? Uh, yeah, yeah. Babe, baby, you gotta get natural first. Oh, natural? Nice again, yeah! Hey, Dad, 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 When we did that scream test. <laughs> Who's ready for the movie? Me! Okay. Hold on, let me hear him. Let me try it again. I can't hear you. <laughs> Ooh, okay, okay. Sounds like they're ready to see the movie. Ooh. Almost that time. Almost that time, y'all. See the movie. Yes, sir. Watermelon. Yes, sir, buddy. Yes, sir, Paulette. Watermelon. Yes, sir, Paulette. <laughs> What's she say? Yeah. Y'all make sure y'all say thank you to the queen. Thank you, boo. <laughs> you welcome, girl. Thank you, queen. You welcome, king. Prince. Prince. Thank you, Queen. Thank you, Queen. Thank you, Queen. Princesses. Thank you, Queen. Natural, you want some watermelon? Let me get Natty Poo a little piece. Come on. Natty, you want watermelon? Natty Poo want to taste some, y'all. Want to taste some watermelon, Mama? Want to taste some watermelon? Taste it, Mama. Taste it. Oh, no. Taste it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Y'all think she's too young for watermelon? And nah, then she not, baby, because we came out the womb eating it. You hear me? L literally. Yours has one more nervous breakdown. If a train traveling 25 miles per hour leaves the station.
Did you pass me the strawberries? 